Hey guys, so today I'm going to be doing my first Ask I Vet, and I have been doing Q&As, but then I kind of figured like it would be more exciting if I just called it hashtag Ask I Vet. So this is my first one. So here we go. How do you keep your eyelashes long? That's really kind of like a weird question. So I just went cross that around because there's like a piece of fuzz right now. Okay, well, I don't really know how I keep my eyelashes long, but I heard that if you put petroleum jelly or Vaseline on your eyelashes like every night before you go to sleep then it like makes them grow I don't, I don't really know but I was born with long lashes so what are your plans for spring break hashtag ask me that my plans for spring break is going in my backyard because I don't have any friends that have a pool unfortunately um and just lay there tan because I'm pale as a mother trucker yoga pants or leggings definitely oh shoot that's a really hard question yoga leggings that yeah What's your opinion on Justin and Selena? I honestly love them so much. Like, that is one perfect couple right there. And I just hope that they get married one day. Even though they keep going on and off with the relationship. What's your favorite drink as in Starbucks and soda? My favorite Starbucks is the double chocolate chip frappuccino or a caramel frapp. So, yeah. And my favorite soda is Sprite. Favorite song from Justin Bieber? That's a really hard one. Advice for people who want to start cheer. So, uh, I actually gave a girl on kick some advice for trying out for cheer. So, let me just read off what I told her. Hey, when you tried out for a cheer, did you have to make up your own cheer routine? I said, they make a few cheers and one dance, and you memorize them. And you try out with two other girls in a group. And so, there's a total of three girls, and you have about four to five judges watching and you need to have great facials and be very peppy and they'll be like yes I want her and especially if you go to tumbling I recommend that you go to tumbling because if you go to tumbling and you learn to do your back handspring they're gonna be like yes I need that girl right there on my team and you will have like an automatic spot on the team so I recommend that you get your back handspring but unfortunately for those of you that didn't know I'm not gonna be trying out for cheer for my junior year which will be next year um, trials for me are in April, but I'm not going to be able to try out because personal reasons and stuff, you know. So I'm not going to be able to do cheer next year. But it's okay because this time I can actually be in the bleachers watching the football games and the basketball games. What would you do if Justin Bieber followed you? I would probably faint. I would have a heart attack and I'd probably end up dying because that's crazy. How did you become so flexible? Did you want to do cheerleading when you were younger? So I became, f I don't really know how I became flexible, like I just, when I was little I was always flexible, that sounds like really like weird, but um, I would always just like pick my leg up and just like shoot it up in the air, I don't, I don't really know, I just, I was a weird child and I just practiced my cartwheels when I was really little because my Aunt Rosie, she actually did cartwheels because she was like younger and I don't know, she just taught me how to do cartwheels and stuff, and then after that I just started like doing the splits and stuff and I just always knew how to be flexible I guess when I was little and yes I did want to do cheerleading ever since I was little because I don't know if you guys got these papers but there is like a little list that you get from um, elementary school I was always like oh I really want to try cheer but then it was like kind of expensive so I never really did it but it was just like for you know like the cheerleading at the park and stuff but I never did it but then I finally got around to doing it in high school and that was a really good experience two years so, I don't really know if I'm going to be going back to doing cheerleading junior or senior year, but at least I got two years to do it, and then the rest of the two years, I could just, you know, hang out. When are you going to do a boyfriend tag, and can you follow me, and I love your videos. I'm going to be doing the boyfriend tag with my boyfriend, of course, um, once we hit one year. And we're currently eight months, so it'll just be a few more months until we do the boyfriend tag. So, we'll do it in July, I'm hoping. I'm hoping. No promises, but I really hope that we do because we've talked about it and he's down to do it. And now to go find you and follow you. Looking for you. Okay, there you are. Julie, and now follow. Can I have your face? Sure, just take it off right now. I'll, let's exchange faces. Come on, you know. Casual. Will a spring haul slash lookbook be coming soon? Hashtag ask I then. Hashtag I is queen. Well, thank you. And yes, I will be doing a spring haul, hopefully, because I saw some really cute things at G-Stage. You guys know I love my G-Stage, but um, 
yeah I really want to do a spring haul if I have enough money I will probably do that and also I really want to do a lookbook I think I'm gonna do it either tomorrow if I have time or not I don't really know but they are coming soon why are you so perfect and slay miss queen well I am a part of the slaying three if you guys didn't know and if you guys don't know what that is where have you guys been have you been living under a rock I don't know but if you guys don't know who the slaying three is it's slay that Slayler and Slay Drew. So I don't know. I'll leave their Twitters and their Instagrams and their YouTubes down below because they all have that. So go subscribe, go follow, and go yeah, stalk them. It's kind of like our little clique. We all go to the same school and we're all YouTubers, so it's kind of like you know, it's a thing. What do you do when you're bored? I film because that's what makes me happy. Who do you love more, Slay Drew or Slayler? Is that even a question? Do you want any piercings or tattoos? Yes, I actually want um, my cartilage pierced and my tragus pierced and I want my belly button pierced. And I also want like two more piercings right here, like three piercings on, you know, right there. Can you do a mascara routine? Um, I've been getting this requested a lot, but I don't know if you guys would want to see that because it's basically just like one mascara that I use. So I don't really know if you guys want that mascara routine, but if you want to know, then let me know in the comments because I want to do something that you guys wouldn't want to watch. Do you like pizza? Yes, who doesn't? Besides Slayler because she's a weirdo and she doesn't, she doesn't like pizza, I don't know why. Describe Slayler and Slay Drew. We basically all slay. Slay, slay, slay. Explain to the world how much Slay Drew and Slayler Slay. Well, basically, Slay Drew slays a lot. And Slayler slays a lot. And I slay more than them. If you could only listen to one song for the rest of your life, what song would it be? It would probably be Treasure by Bruno Mars because if you guys didn't know, my boyfriend Mason dedicated that song to me before we started going out and or dating. And I will link the song down below. Really cute. So that song has always been like our song because... You know, it just, it's cute. What's a good moisturizer to use for the face? Kind of trying to stay away from foundation now that it's hot. Um, a really good moisturizer is the one by Clinique, the gel one. It's like in a little um, square packaging and it has kind of like a light yellow um, moisturizer. And it's really good. It's really moisturizing and it's not oily at all and it makes your face feel super fresh. Why are you so fabulous? I can ask you the same thing. How did Mason react when you told him about YouTube? I actually never told him about YouTube. The first time that I met him, and I'm not really going to go into depth of when I met him or how I met him because we're going to explain that in the boyfriend tag, so you guys have to stay okay. tuned for that. And then my best friend Taylor, Taylor um, Pena, different Taylor, um, she went and she told Mason that I thought he was cute because I... Okay, 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 this is getting into too much detail, so basically... My best friend Taylor, when I first met Mason, told him, oh yeah, that's my YouTube famous friend over there. And so that's basically how he found out, and he was like, she's YouTube famous, really? I know, I mean, I don't consider myself to be YouTube famous, but my friends do, because, you know. So he was just like, really? She's on YouTube? I don't, I don't know. He thinks it's cool. How do you make time for your videos in school? It's actually really hard because I have YouTube, school, um, jiu-jitsu, and cheer. So really, really hard. But I just make kind of like a schedule. Like I do my homework first and then make sure that all that is done. And then I don't know because if I don't do my homework, I feel like something's like really bugging me because I know that's going to really bring down my grade. So I just like go for that first and then when I have free time and I'm bored I'm just like ooh I got time for YouTube so that's what I do. How do you do your eyeliner without messing it up? Comment down below if you guys want an eyeliner routine to show you guys how I do my eyeliner. Twitter or Insta? I really like both because Twitter I can interact with you guys more and I just think it's really funny. And then Instagram it's all about the selfies. So that is basically all the questions that I got for this time and that I can actually have time to answer. So if you guys weren't in this, then just do it next month because I'm going to try to do an Ask Aida every single month. So just keep up on my Twitter, so go follow me on that. I'll talk to you guys later.